The Biden administration has approved updates to the SNAP benefits program, giving families who currently receive food stamps one of the largest increases in the program's history. Our 18 News reporter Rhea Jha is live in the 18 News Satellite Center with the details. Rhea. Good evening, Zach and Jordan. SNAP benefits, formerly known as food stamps, will increase by more than 25% on October 1st. And to give you some context on how many people will be affected by this, one in seven New Yorkers are on SNAP benefits as of 2019, and that number has probably increased due to the pandemic. This is coming as a result of a reevaluation of the plan used to calculate the average SNAP benefit called the Thrifty Food Plan. A local food bank director says this is long overdue. The calculation of SNAP benefits that we are currently using was actually created in the 70s and it hasn't taken into consideration changes not only in food costs, but also what people are actually eating and how um, the prices of various uh, components of a healthy diet have shifted over time. In a press release, U.S. Agriculture Secretary said, quote, a modernized thrifty food plan is more than a commitment to good nutrition. It's an investment in our nation's health, economy, and security. The average benefits per person will increase by around $36 per month. If you think you qualify for SNAP benefits, you can apply through your state's SNAP website. Live in the Satellite Center, Rhea Jaw, 18 News.